hi to everyone today we'll discuss about memories memory is the main part of any processor in order to store the data during program execution and after completion of the task the result will be stored in the memory so memory is nothing but a, it is also one of the ic it is used to store the either program or data so now we can go for uh, classification of uh, memories or types of memories so memories memories are mainly classified in uh, three different types random access memory serial access memory content addressable memory so these are the general uh, memory now once again uh, random access memory divided into the two parts read and write memory that is nothing but ram memory it is a volatile memory so read only memory rom it is a non volatile memory so rom is also divided into uh, once into four different types programmable rom erasable uh, programmable and electrically erasable and flash rom so these are the uh, different types of uh, random sorry read access <coughs> read only memory so this programmable means changes the data in rom based on either uh, electrical or based on uh, ultraviolet rays so like that we can divide the different uh, type among these flash rom is used for general applications it is a fast memory so now uh, read and write memory uh, ram ram is uh, also again divided into the two types uh, static ram and uh, dynamic ram static ram is used for uh, uh, storage temporary data by using the transistors uh, dynamic mix changes here we can you go you uh, use capacitor based uh, memory so that is a dynamic mean changes either charging state and uh, discharging state next coming into the serial access memory serial in the sense we can use uh, either shift registers or q q is divided into two types first in first out last in first out type shift register serial in parallel out parallel in serial out so these are the uh, classification of memories so main memory divided into uh, main memory or primary memory divided into the two types one is uh, random access memory and primary memory memory or main memory divided into the two types uh, read write memory and uh, read only memory so random access memory is also uh, chip is used to store the data temporarily during program execution time so it consists of a millions of transistors <coughs> and capacitors so uh, this random access memory again depends on the static and the dynamic static memory also it is also nothing but ic in case of static memory you can use the flip flops and transistor to store the uh, data temporarily so static ram is very uh, fast and consumes low power so here you see the uh, uh, static ram implemented six transistors based yes ram so here you can go for uh, six transistors are cross connection <coughs> so based on wl means writing and bl means reading and math so like that we can go for implementation of the uh, random access memory that is a static memory <coughs> so this is a basic diagram for implementation so based on the wl uh, input the transistor will be on condition or off condition on means it will store one off means it will be uh, zero suppose wl uh, one means m5 will be on Uh, that is given to the <coughs> uh, next uh, the output of m5 is given to the m4 m4 one means m4 will be off so next to go for this is the previous one uh, zero means m2 will be also off condition total will be output become to um, zero so like that we can go for explanation of the uh, static ram So next to go for dynamic RAM. Dynamic RAM stores each bit of memory in capacitor in the integrated circuit. Real capacitors uh, it will be leaky charge. So capacitors need to refresh periodically. So the structure of uh, random dynamic RAM is shown in the figure. Uh, it will using the <coughs> transistor along with the capacitor. Based on the uh, input voltage, low line uh, one means charging, uh, zero means. discharging like that we can go for charging state and discharging state so that is this one next go for rom read only memory <coughs> in this uh, only you can read the data we can't uh, write the data into the 
memory so that is types of rom programmable read only memory electrically erasable program memory but in case of uh, programmable read only memory once the information is recorded it cannot be changed uh, erasable means we can change erasable the data based on our requirement either electrically or uh, ultraviolet rays based memory so in case of uh, electrically erasable programmable read only memory memory is erased by electrical signals next cache memory is 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 in between main memory and secondary memory by using this we can uh, speed up the processor secondary memory is used for uh, permanent storage uh, purpose so it some supplements the main memory it is permanent memory programs as well as data so classification of uh, secondary memory magnetic type based storage device mm, magnetic type floppy disk hard disk optical storage media and uh, cd and dvd roms these are the different uh, types of secondary memories used so the uh, important thing is how to find out address array structure memory architecture it is a repeated question for jntu anandpur uh, explain the memory accessing or memory architecture here we can uh, show the block diagram of memory architecture see in order to find out particular uh, address the total address divided into the uh, column wise and row wise in case of row wise uh, some inputs are given and column wise in into some column wise inputs are given then we can go for amplify the sensitivity um, find out sensitivity means to find out the uh, correct row and the column um, find out once we can call, um, touching the both rows and columns then it will find out the storage uh, memory address location so like that searching for rows and searching for column wise finally can uh, rows and column will be uh, whenever it will be uh, uh, touched the both or <coughs> significance the uh, both at the same point that point we can uh, find out the uh, required memory location from the two required memory location we can uh, either data retrieve or send the data memory read operation or memory write operation that is the uh, array structured <coughs> memory architecture so finally we can go for comparison of different types of uh, memories uh, in case of sram dram and flash speed in case of uh, sram very fast dram fast very slow in case of uh flash memory density low high very high endurance better better poor power low high very low refresh non equal to sram dram as flash as retention means uh, it is a <coughs> volatile or non volatile it is uh, nature in it is availability volatile volatile non volatile scalable means good bad good in the sense in future it will be adjustable mechanism by stable as capacitor and <coughs> fine tunneling it's um, like that we can go for comparison of uh, different memories this is a complete description about uh, memories okay thank you one and all